My name is Liz and I work at Randall's Island Park. Now some of you might have been there before. There's something at Randall's Island Park for everyone. We have sports fields, we have our famous Icon Stadium track, we have um, lots of gardens and we have a farm as well. However, we also have a fair amount of uh, areas known as natural areas and specifically I'm talking about wetlands. Specifically, we're going to be talking about our salt marsh. This is the Little Hellgate Salt Marsh. It's an estuary. An estuary is a kind of wetland where you're going to have salt water mixing with fresh water. We get our salt water from the Atlantic Ocean and our fresh water from the Hudson River. Estuaries are one of the most biodiverse ecosystems in the whole world. Many different animals and plants can find the food, water, and shelter they need to make their habitat within a salt marsh. Today, we're going to be learning about one specific marsh resident who scuttles around in the sand and burrows into the mud. Can you guess who it is? It's a crab. This is a fiddler crab. It makes its home right here in the marsh. Fiddler crabs are a type of crustacean. They're animals that are related to things like lobsters and shrimp. These crabs are smaller in size less than two inches, or about the size of this acorn. Hmm. Here we're looking where to find some fiddler crabs. They hide underneath rocks and burrow into the sand and mud. They prefer to be in shallow water along the shore. They like to come out and feed during low tide and retrieve back to their shelters when the tide starts to rise. You shouldn't disturb these crabs unless you're with a professional. Ooh, here's one in their burrow. Fiddler crabs play an important part in keeping a marsh healthy. Their burrows aerate the soil, which means bringing air to the soil for other living things to use. One thing that you notice about a fiddler crab is that they have one claw that is much larger than the other. Only male fiddler crabs have this large claw called a keela. Females have two normal sized claws. They wave their keela around and use it to fight with other males and also to attract the females. Fiddler crabs are also decapods, meaning that they have 10 legs. <laughs> They use these legs mainly to walk. They don't like to swim much when they're adults. Like all crabs, fiddlers have gills they use to breathe underwater and a simple lung they use to breathe on land. They eat tiny, tiny things like pieces of algae. Males use their smaller claw to pick up these pieces of algae and bring it to their mouth to eat. Fiddler crabs are an essential organism to any estuary. They take care of the soil and are also a source of food for other predators like herons and large fish. As spring emerges, they'll scuttle out of hibernation and come to life once again. If you'd like to see these amazing crabs up close, visit Randall's Island during any of our educational events. Once again, my name is Liz. Thank you so much for watching this video and learning about fiddler crabs with us. Um, we hope that you check us out online and on our social media websites. Thanks. Stay safe. Bye.